some people look at you and then conclude you so badly. They conclude you so badly that behaving as if they are your God. That behaving as if they are the one who give birth to you. Even the woman who give birth to you, the Bible says, can a mother, can a mother forget a sucking baby? The Bible says, even when the mother forget a sucking baby, he said, God, I, God, has not forget you that created you. Even when your mother and your father forget you, God says, I have not forget you. You are not a normal human being. Anybody joking with you is playing with his destiny. Yes. Because you that are joking with today, you will be the one helping the person tomorrow. Am I speaking to somebody here? I am preaching my life to you. I don't know who brought you down. I don't know what brought you down. Today you will rise back again. Take your seat. Take your seat. My air will grow again. Judges chapter 16. Judges 16. Judges 16 verse 22. I feel the word of God on my head. I will prophesy. Follow me up. I will close you today. Anytime I like. If not 12 o'clock in the afternoon, I close you. If not 9, I close you. If not 6 in the morning, I, close, I bet I will close you at when I know I'm through with you. Allow me to work on you. Your case don't tire me. I need millionaires. I need billionaires. My vision too big. Only one thing they delay my vision. Now only money now they delay my vision. Anointing is not a problem. I have vision. If you enter my office, if I show you what is in my head, you will shout. That I plan everything is well drawn down and is waiting for one thing. Money now they wait. I came here today with annoyance. Your case don't tire me. I want to have some sons and daughters that I can call. If I add a challenge, I can put the goal to some here, can you get me 20 million naira? And one of my son or my daughter will say, Yeah, Papa, I profess. Whatsoever that tie you down, you will be loose today. Judges chapter 16, verse 22. Everybody break your Bible to Judges 16, verse 22. Judges chapter 16, verse 22. How be it? Yeah. of his head began to grow after he was shaved. That this was the story of Samson and Delilah. Every time I preach about Delilah, I preach with passion and revelation. Sometimes I preach the character of the good side of Delilah. And sometimes I tell you the danger part of Delilah. Every time I look at this story, I pity Samson. The Bible says, for the start, I begin with this yearly. The problem, all the problems of Samson's life was caused because of the star of Samson. No problem will come into an empty destiny. Every empty destiny will not have any challenge. The sign that your future is guaranteed is the problems a man faces. The approval of God upon every human being is a problem that the person faces. When there is a heat of challenges, heat of problems, heat of challenges, there is an handwriting on the wall that you have a bright future. Am I speaking to somebody? When it comes to a point where your house rent cannot be paid, your children's school fees, your wife you cannot feed, nothing is working, you have entered your corner, that nothing, everybody is ready to look at your face, you are close to a miracle. The Bible says, towards the dawn of a new day, it's the darkest hour. You are close, anytime you are close to something, anytime you are close to a manifestation of a miracle, everywhere we belong. Samson! Does not invite the trouble. Samson was on his own. Because of the star of Samson, a whole city gathered against him. They said, How can we bring this man down? Who they plan against you go plan and fail. Yeah, you know you're with here they talk. Any meeting going on in your compound, in your father's house, in your mother's house, in where you are working, any meeting going on against you, the meeting will scatter. Not like your amen. The meeting will scatter. Amen. The 
their meeting will scatter. Amen. Sit down. The Bible says, Samson, sometimes he talks people around his house, the corner of his house. People are taking meeting. He talks they are taking meeting for good thing. You never know. That meeting is for his downfall. People are planning. They will pour drink on the ground. They will discuss. They will drink minerals. They will drink out. They will act. What can we do about Samson? They never know. Samson talk. That meeting was a good meeting for him. He never know. They are taking meetings and strategizing how they can bring him down. And the people plan all the planning. They begin to celebrate. We have gotten him. Remember, it was three times Delilah tested Samson. Three. It was in the third one Delilah succeeded Samson. First second, she couldn't succeed. It was Samson's foolishness that made Delilah to get him. Delilah didn't use a knife. Delilah didn't use a gun. Delilah asked him, what is the secret of my mouth? And Mumu spirit, I told you before, anytime we go heaven, the first person I will ask is Samson. I will ask Holy Spirit or anybody in the gate of the heavens. I say, where is Samson? Where is Samson? I want to see him. And if I see him, I will slap him. And when God asks me, why do you slap Samson? I will tell him, Samson was an idiot. You know, say this woman won't kill you and you allow her to kill you. Sit down. Very, very mumu. In your English, yeah? Very, very what? And Samson told Delilah, the secret of my power is my air. Cut off my air. And they asked, what did Delilah do Samson? Take a bullet more. Where do you bullet your crocodile crocodile? I'm mean, waiting and touch and touch and wear. Before only a man go to confess, kill me, cut off my hair. Don't kill me, cut off my. I wonder which kind of touch is that. It's a cut off my hair. Instantly, Delilah blow a whistle. <laughs> The men gather. After she has dosed him with a good pepper soup, the woman has so shocked him that Samson was not himself. Because if Samson was in himself, his normal sense, hundred persons cannot hold him down. It's a strength God give him. He's the only man that only lion, not be medicine. He only a lion. Only a lion with ordinary arm. He opened the mouth of a lion and tore a lion. So that kind of person, even 200 person cannot fight him. Am I speaking to somebody here? That was a supernatural strength that God gave to Samson. There are people sitting down here. Now one boom, then get. They're small, but don't temper them. If they give you boom, you will never recover. That was a natural strength. God gives something. So the all I miss for the woman to manipulate something was to say that they give him certain things to weaken his spirit. So the woman prepared. Delilah prepared. And she weakened the spirit of Samson. Immediately that she blew away stone. And then gathered. And the old Samson. They said, Nobody, you will define all this, yes? You finish, man. You will not go finish. Anybody say, Well, you don't finish, you never finish. Make I speak a language where you can understand. Anybody where you say, Your mama should then don't finish. I say, Oh, no, no, go finish. <laughs> you not go finish. Yeah. Anybody like, let them tell you any negative story. Believe what I am telling you. I am your pastor. I am the only one standing to tell you the mind of God. The Bible says, for which report will you believe? The report of men or the report of God? The Bible says, let every man be a liar. Let only Jesus become the truth. Am I speaking to somebody here? Who is it that say yet a thing and it come to pass when God has not commanded? Anybody can say what they like over your life. Anybody can say you will not progress. Anybody can say your story is finished. Anybody can conclude your destiny. Let God have something to tell you. Am I 
just speaking to somebody here. I don't care what you feel about me. I guess about what God feels about me. I don't care what you think about me. I guess about what God thinks about me. Am I speaking to somebody here? The decision of man is not the decision of God. The decision of God has the final say over our destiny. So when they conclude something, then conclude something and then tie him down. When they tie him, then ask for the razor blade. While he was on deep sleep, then shave his hair. When Samson got himself, he do the strength was no more. He do the strength was no more. And Delilah that just few minutes ago naked for him to make love with her. Delilah began to do not all. Don't you know I'm in this house because of this thing? And your enemy can be patiently in your house tracking you step to step. Our enemies are patient with us. They are not in haste. They can stay with us 100 years but they are planned. One day I will get him. One day I will get her. Enemies that are fighting us are patient. They are not in rush. They are taking their step one by one. Then try to they fail again that we are rich. Try again that we, that's why I have no pity for anybody that is a winch. If you confess, we will leave you alone. But as long as he refuses to confess, die. Die. Let us rest. Our country and society, all the manner of problems is happening because of too much wickedness. If God does not show his anointing for vengeance in this end time, very soon we can no more enter church. If the anointing of vengeance does not appear in the churches, very soon people will no more enter church. Because the wickedness is not just increasing, it has fly. Am I speaking to somebody here? And then tie something down. Shave his head. And when he woke up, he was crying. He said, God, I know I am a human being. I have sinned against you. And because of my sins, my power has left me. Something begin to cry. Something begin to cry for restoration. Oh God of restoration, restore me. Oh God of restoration, restore me. The Bible says, after a while, so be he. That God who make the second chance. God who does not conclude on the mistake of a man. God who does not take advice of a man to wicked a man. God who died, who sent his son, Jesus, to die on the cross. Yet in the place of his son, he still had mercy for us. He look at Samson, he says, if I allow this man, these people will laugh him. And these people will think I am not existing. Let me allow his heir to go again. Then thought Samson's story has ended. But to God, it was not ended. Am I speaking to somebody here? Yes, what am I trying to let you know? The conclusion of man is not the conclusion of God. I don't know what you put your hand that could not work. And you are giving up. You are getting discouraged. Come on, shut up. Don't be discouraged. On Monday morning, enter that place back. They say you cannot enter the office. I said enter the office. They say you cannot have that contract. I said you will have it back. Am I speaking to somebody here? They said that payment will not work. I said that payment will work. Now me they tell you that payment will work. If your amen is louder, it will happen to you. Take a seat. The Bible says I'm so big that something air begin to grow again. It's air. Command the kobalata. When the air grow, the Bible speaking that the powers that something demonstrate become more powerful than the former one. God is a faithful God. He will not use your mistake to kill you. God is a faithful God. Only Satan give and take. God does not give and take. The blessings of the Lord, He make it richer and He added no sorrow. Am I speaking? to somebody here. You will live here with a blessing. You will live here with your breakthrough. You will live here with your breakthrough. Shout it, yes! Sit down. 
I feel something entering my body. Holy Ghost, let me preach first. I want to prophesy here. Let me preach first. The air of something begin to go again. I don't know who look you down. They shall look you up. Am I speaking to people here? I don't know who look you down. They shall look you up. I came here for your enemies. I came here to disappoint all your enemies. All those who have concluded their story, I have a good news for you. They shall come and beg for me. Sit down, sit down. Oh, that's monkey banana. Many years ago, if somebody tell me, Jojo Doko from our Lord and the Company, you will become a popular figure all over the world. Different countries, people are calling for my attention. Jojo Doko, come to our country. Come and do crusade in our country. Who oh, that's monkey banana? My mother was a laughing stock. Who oh, that's monkey banana? What oh, Doko family? Who there anywhere before? Who oh, that's monkey banana? I don't care where you came from. God will raise you up. Sit down, sit down. I feel. I feel something. Am I okay? Yes. I feel something. Don't mind me. I am not a normal pastor. I feel something. The guy watching the move my body. Anyone here will confess this night. As you finish this service, some of you will see a missed call. Call back the number. Somebody will be confessing in your village. Anybody where you hold something that belongs to you, they will live here alone and they will confess. How many of you are here? If you're here, many slander, you are that person. Sit down. Open your hand. Let go, Zakadaya. Or look at Doko. Go a man in the day. Or look at Nanamo. Go go Ziadayaka. Or look at Keke. Or Doko, Doko, Doko. There is a wedding gown falling upon a young girl. There is a wedding gown falling upon a young girl. Or look at Doko, Zakabia, Lakata. Or Lea, Ubabu, Okowo. Or Lea, Kakaya. Kari, Asa. Kari, Damasa. Kari, Damasa. Kari, Damasa. Look at all Joko, Yagadia. Sit down. If you stand, my body, they do me one car. That devil is a liar. That devil is a liar. I sell I sell ice cream for village. Yet I break the record. I don't know where they limit your destiny. You will break the record. 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 All of you, open your hand. No, 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 no. Sit down. People came from everywhere. There are people from Lagos. There are people from the north. There are people from the east. There is one person from Cross River that called me, that he says in this meeting. Cross River. Somebody from where? Lome. Lome Togo, die. Came for this all night. I have you. I owe you a debt. And the credit I owe you, I must pay. Your miracle is what I owe you. I didn't come here to look at your face. I didn't come here to look at you. I came here to give you that thing you are waiting for. Within now to December, people will look at you and they will not know you well. Life is turn by turn. Your turn is coming. Your turn has started. 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 Shadiyah! Sit down. It's a so big that the air of something begin to grow again.
again. When even something have, something have concluded his destiny. Something said, don't give up. But God never give up. To men it is impossible. But to God, all things are possible. Man says it cannot happen. But God said, that shall be your beginning. Am I speaking to somebody here? Anybody that have it from you, that is laughing you now. Wait until I finish your prophecy. Anybody you have feed, you have help. Now they are turning you to become a laughing stock. Because things are not working. I have a good news for you. 42 days. Oh, the God of second chance will knock on your door. Amen. I'm not like what you talk here. I said 42 days. The God of second chance will do bum 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 in your door. Amen. Sit down. He said the air of Samson begin to go again. At that time, Delilah have gone. Delilah thought she has finished him. There are people who conclude and prepare everything about you and they keep you. Say, this one, don't finish. This is our friend, don't finish. Then look for another person. Then look at your mother's children. He said, this woman, all your children, nobody can become anything. Some people are talking as if they are the one who created you. I say a story. I say some people quarrel with people and they will talk to the other people, family. Say your family says somebody did. Oh, because you get people, you not going to allow us rest. Your family says somebody did. Oh, so people will not get people for family. No go talk again. Your family self, somebody there. That talk, only God is permitted to make that kind of comment. Your family self, somebody there. So we will not get people. No go feel talk again. Your family self, somebody there. You will people there. Continue your life. Life is turn by turn. Some years ago, some family been get people. Today, they no get. Another people now ain't get. This thing, they rotate. Now, so you the worker. Position yourself for the right place. You go rotate, touch you one day. In that year English for here. Now rotate this thing, they rotate. Now rotate it, they rotate. Nobody break to intimidate me. Now rotate. If this is your time, you are shining. Go ahead and shine. Drive your car, enjoy your life. I am waiting for my time. Am I speaking to somebody here? It they rotate. When you rotate, rotate, you can't land for your demot. Family winches will be asleep. If, hear this, if God said today, now your day. No family wish. That day, there will be an holiday. Because God never talk, now make them the boast. If God said today is your day, no power. I tell you, I tell you no power at the right to stop the mandate of God upon your life. Am I speaking to somebody here? Open your hand. Open your hand. I like those of you who are awake. You, you mean business. Open your hand. I don't know what fight your father. Foundational powers. You can't stop me. I don't know what fight your mother. 72 of you. Now, before I close, you will escape from that manipulation. Amen. The people at the door side, you are not shouting amen. I want to hear your shout amen. Sit down. My air begin to go again. See, yeah, this normally when a man's head is shaving, after some days he go back. Some people are talking as if they don't know the one that created. He's a perfect creator. When they capture the head, he knows that the head will go again. But Delilah forgot. 
the mystery of God's creation. At that time, Delilah was suspended on the air. Her mind was thinking of another thing. If she knew, she could have cut off his hair. But Satan manipulated. Don't you know? The people that killed Jesus, if they know that killing him will become an escape for the world, they will not kill him. God has to use them to fulfill mandate. God has to use the enemy to fulfill destiny. Some of them are they kicking you about. They are kicking you to your destiny. Who they push you? Who they intimidate you? Who say you go lock your door? Because you know if you pay house rent. Hear me and hear me well. If they push you out, they are pushing you to your destiny. In life, hear this. In life, no challenge, no breakthrough. See that? No challenge, no breakthrough. For you to know that your future is bright is by the challenge. Any pastor who want to start church and rise just like that, he will do juju. For you to grow, you must face tough times. Many years ago, I don't tell for this work. I preach with experience. Many years ago, it was not like this. Many years ago, not beside day, that my elder can tell you. Few days ago, that my elder, if you see me, then I said tears, they come off my high. He was telling me even this evening, Pastor, you know, sir, this television where they talk, 12 years ago, now they talk this television. 12 years ago, every service I go stand for altar, we will get our TV station. No sponsor. No sponsor. We get our TV. How? I don't know. I was talking it. 12 years. The first day I start our church, that man started with me from Kayama. He has stayed with me over 12 years. And his family and people, they are still with me. The vision was big, but no helper. We push it on like that. I said, no! If God will not give me the money and blessings, may I never have it, I will wait. The reason why we are still like this is because we are waiting for God. And we will continue to wait. God has the capacity to do it. He will do it. God may come late, but he will become the latest. You know the year English for here. Your miracle may come late, but it will become the latest. Are you sleeping or are you shouting amen here? Amen. It may come late, but it will become the latest. At the verse. How many of you, your mother no build house? Or your father no build house? Even the house one that claims one that build, that will not be building. Our house that is called our house. Your father property is called our house. When elder come, then go tell you to move to another room because there is a family elder that come. It's not your house, it's our open your hand. Anybody who shave your head that appear, then let me make you understand. The shavers of earth. Some people you give money. And they use the money against you in the realms of the spirit. They shave your finances. You went there to marry. Somebody had about it and lie against you. They shave your marriage. Some people, when you are born, in the place of where you want to collect your brain, say you will not go to school. They shave your educational career. Anybody who shave your head. Today, the God of restoration will restore your destiny. Amen. I don't like your amen. The God of restoration will restore that in the collector. Amen. The God of restoration will restore that in the collector. Amen. Somebody say, my head will grow again. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. My name is Apostle George Odoko, the senior pastor of Eagles Palace International. I want to be grateful to God for your life 
for what you have heard. I hope this message met you well. I hope you enjoyed the message. It's what we enjoy in Eagles Palace, undiluted word of God, where you come and you sit under the atmosphere of the divine arrangement of God, where you hear word, you hear prophecy, you hear the reality of God's presence. It's what we enjoy. God has empowered us with so much anointing to dish out in this end time. This is a place you will never like to miss. I want to be grateful to God for your life. In case you have heard me and you are, you are touched by the word of God, you want to give your life to Jesus for what you have heard, I, I, will, I, will, I will tell you to pray with me because the best decision a man will take is to give his life to Christ. The reason why we are on air and we are paying so much money to be on television to get our private TV is because we want to reach out to the world, to convert the world to come back to God. So straight your two hands to the television screen you are watching as I lead you to Christ. Speak after me, say, Lord Jesus, come into my life. I receive you as my personal Lord and Savior. From today, Satan, I deny you, Jesus, I embrace you. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. If you have prayed this one, you are just a born again. There is no condemnation for those who are in Christ. You are just a born again. The Lord bless you. Look for a Bible-believing church and go around you. And in case you find yourself in Bayasa or Africa, in Nigeria, Niger Delta, I want you to come around to worship with us in Bayasa State in Nigeria. We enjoy God's presence. It's a place you will never like to miss. Come around and Lord bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. Grace is speaking for you in Jesus' name. I want to implore you to worship with us every Wednesday. On Wednesday, 3 o'clock to 7. 3 in the afternoon to 7 p.m. in the evening. Every Wednesday. On Thursday, one on one. All over the world is gathering to see me in my counseling days. That is the only day made in the week to see me. On Thursday. You come early to pick your car and you patiently wait to see us. Then on Friday, we have our service again from 3 p.m. to 7 p.m. in the evening, the same time. On Sunday, we have two services we are running. And one is in Kayama and the second one is in Yenegua. The one in Kayama is 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. And the one in Yenegua, second service starts from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. I want you to take out this date and follow up my services and come around. The Lord bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. It's a place you would like to come. If you come once, I tell you, even the color of your skin will change. You will tell others what will happen to you. It's an atmosphere you worship and you will feel the presence of God. The Lord has given us our private television station called Eagles Palace TV. Eagles Palace TV. We are grateful to God for what God has done for us in our ministry. All over the world, people have been seeking and asking, man of God, when will your TV start? Finally, it has kick off. I want you to tell those who have not heard that Eagles Palace TV has kick off fully and all over the world is ending to watch it. I want you to tell those who have not heard, if you hear it, send it on Facebook. Send it, please. Tell people that Eagles Palace TV is on board and it's live 24 hours of the day. Miracles are happening unexplainable. We cannot count from the day we started. The testimonies received is unexplainable. I want you to partake on it, wash it, make it your family station in your bedroom, in your office, even in your toilet, even in your kitchen. Make it your your station. Make it your make this TV your the station of your family. Make it the family station 24 hours. Wash it. Sickness, no witch can be in your house as a wash it. No poverty can be in your house. Nobody can dream bad things. Kick it off till daybreak. Let it be playing in your house. And the Lord bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. The Lord bless you. Tell those who have not had Heroes Palace TV has fully come on board. And by the grace of God, we have continued and no going back. The Lord bless you in Jesus' name. If this TV has been a blessing to you, anytime you watch it, maybe you are here. As you are watching it, I got some strong revelations of the word of God and you want to talk to us. Please send a message to our Facebook page. You will watch the Facebook page on the TV. Eagles Palace TV Facebook page. Eagles Palace TV Facebook page. Please send your message to the Facebook page and we will receive it. And in case you want to send your prayer request, you can text it. The numbers on your phone. You can text it directly to me. Direct the prayer point to me and I will print it out and I will lay my hands on in a prayer for you. The reason why we are on air is not to show Cinemadia. It's not for showcase. We are on air to meet to your needs, to meet to your challenge, to remove that trouble, that stubborn problem in your life. That is why we are on air. We pay millions.
millions of naira every month to make sure we can wash, you can wash us to make sure we can enter your family, enter your life to remove that trouble. And I want you to send me, in case you want to send me a message, please send me an indicate where you are sending from, so that we will know where you are sending up, so we will know how far the television is going, it's a new television station, so we will know how far the TV is going. Are you watching me around Bayasa, Ninja Delta, Portai, Court, anywhere, Lagos, Abuja? Please wash us, wash us and send us message from where you are washing us. Notice us so that we will know how far the TV is going. The Lord bless you in the name of Jesus. We hope you've been blessed by this broadcast and would like you to reach out to us. You can also order for this message. Please call plus 234-80-645-26800 or plus 234-80-686-59360. Thank you and God bless you.